joining me right now, Strictly Business, or what's left of Strictly Business, the NWA World's Champion, Camille, and Tom Latimer. We've all... I'm sorry, uh, I gotta take this from you, Kyle. To be honest, I've got to get some stuff off my chest. See, me and Nick, we've been, uh, we've been friends since, since we were kids. I mean, you know, we grew up together. We, we started training at the same time. We started wrestling on the UK camp scene at the same time. I and mean, we've been best friends since day one, right? I mean, I was even the best man on his wedding day. I mean, this is real life. This is, this is real. I was his best man on his wedding day. So, Nick was out here the other week and he said that you know, he used to make 30 pounds, 30 pounds a night on the camps, right? That's how much he used to get paid. And he used that money and he saved it so he could go to Harley Race's camp and learn how to be a prof professional wrestler. And I thought, well, that's kind of funny, to be honest, because isn't that typical Nick? He was getting paid 30 pounds a night. And of course, Tom, well, he was only getting paid 25. And then we fast forward a little bit and he gets signed to a big American wrestling promotion and he leaves me in the UK. And when I do finally get to the States, of course he's making the big bucks and I'm making peanuts. And he's the world heavyweight champion. And don't get me wrong, I've got all the respect in the world for you, mate. I really do. But of course, it's you, Nick, and you never get into any trouble. You don't get arrested. You don't mess up opportunities. You don't ruin marriages. No, everything's just hunky-dory for you, isn't it? But you know what you do get? Of course, you get the mansion. You get all the free watches. You get to eat for free in every restaurant in town. Not to mention the free suits. I deserve those things. I do. You use me as a stepping stone to get to those things, to achieve your dreams. You use me. So. I need you, while you're at home, nursing your wounds, to have a good think. Why would Tom, my best friend, do this to me? Well, it was because you got weak, you got pathetic, you lost your eggs besides everything else. So while you're at home, mate, I want you to take a good hard look at yourself in the mirror. Nah. No, actually, I want you to take a good, hard look into your son Donovan's eyes. And I want you to say, son, I'm sorry daddy is a failure. I'm sorry daddy is a loser. I'm sorry daddy is no longer the champion. And I'm sorry that Uncle Tom kick my ass but more importantly son I'm sorry that I lost a best mate <laughs>